Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. I hope you all are doing extremely fine. My name is Prince and you are watching the Tech Stream. In this video, I am going to show you another Android 12 custom ROM, Pixel Blaster and we are going to see if it is stable enough to be used as a daily driver on OnePlus 8 series and OnePlus 9R. So without wasting any more time, let's get started. As you can see that I have installed Pixel Blaster which is an Android 12 based custom ROM on my OnePlus 8T. If we go to the about section, you can see that the Android version is 12 and the ROM is Pixel Blaster and the Android security patch is 5 January 2022. I'll just show you what all you can expect from from this ROM. First of all, the ROM is very stable and has no major bugs or issues. I am using it as a daily driver for the past few days or so and face no issues, lags or frame drops. All the basic functionality just works fine. Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, NFC, Volti, calling and everything just works flawlessly. The fingerprint sensor also works fine but it is a little slow as compared to Android 11 ROMs but it does the job. Moving on, since this is an Android 12 ROM, it supports all the basic features from Android 12 which includes Material U theming, newer UI animation, US notification panel, one-handed mode and all the pixel specific features. Each of the features just works without any problem or issues. Safety net on this ROM does not pass out of this box but the payment apps work just fine. Also the widebind security level is L1 so that means you will be able to stream HD content on Netflix and other streaming websites. Talking about the camera, the ROM comes with Oxygen OS camera and gallery app and yes Oxygen OS camera is fully functional and all the camera modes just work perfectly. Just for for the ultra wide lens, you need to disable ultra wide lens correction in settings, and after that, ultra wide lens will work without any issues. And the Oxygen OS Gallery apps also works without any hiccups. Moving on, if we get into BGMI, you can see that there is no option for 90 FPS, even though the screen refresh rate has been set to 120. I don't know why this is the case with this ROM, as on other custom ROMs, I never had a problem of 90 FPS in BGMI. Talking about the battery, the battery backup is also good, and there are no considered drains as such. On average, I am getting 6 to 7 hours of screen on time. Now, let's talk about the customization options that are available on this ROM. If we go into the settings, you can see the explosive section which has all the customizations. First up, we have monet settings. With this, you can set the accent color or a custom color if you don't like the one generated by monet engine. Next, we have status bar settings. Here, first we have clock settings to change the clock style in status bar. Next up, we have battery indicator options. Then we have traffic indicator settings. And lastly, we have double tap to sleep toggle. Moving on, we have notification settings which has only heads up notification options. Lastly, we have lock screen customizations. We also have some OnePlus settings where we have options like DC dimming, auto high brightness mode, ambient display gestures, FPS overlay, game mode, add system vibrator strength. So those were the customization options that you get with this ROM. Finally, the ROM is good as it is stable and it has Oxygen OS camera fully working. You can have a taste of Android 12 with a stable experience for this one. And there is also a lot of development going on so you can receive a lot of, so you will receive a lot of new features and updates very frequently. Big thanks to the developer for all the hard work. Though the only thing that I feel with this ROM is the less number of customizations and the lack of 90 FPS in BGMI. I'll recommend this ROM to someone who is looking for a ROM which is very close to stock but with not so many customization options and also has Oxygen OS camera. Comment down if you want a video on how to install this ROM on OnePlus 8T. Also I'll make a lot of ROM reviews and I'll be trying another Android 12 ROM such as Dove Fest and Proton. So, Subscribe to the channel to not miss those videos. Thank you for watching.